Francis Godin, and I'm on the music faculty here at Lab. My name is Xinhua Huang. Mr. Jin and I are co-leading this uh, recording projects together. When I learned that we were going to have a recording studio, I had already had a little experience in grad school dabbling with studio musicianship, and I just thought this would be a great opportunity because it's really unique. The recording part of it is being very exciting and not in my regular comfort zone doing what I do every day. It's even more challenging for me, which is the, the reason I'm really looking forward to this project and what the end product will be. Studio recording has definitely helped me as a musician because knowing that you're going to record and knowing that you're working towards a final product is definitely something that motivates not only me but the other musicians that I'm working with to make sure that we're making our product what we all want together. So I think that knowing that in the end we're going to do professional studio recording makes us want to work harder as musicians and make sure that we're all on the same page for every part. I think that uh, this program especially really pulls together all parts of, of this new facility and allows us to really maximize the potential that, that this place has. A one, two, three. The recording studio is totally different from playing a live show. In a live show you can, you can wing things and you can go on for a long time and people play off the energy of the room, but you really need to say everything with your playing. When you're in a recording studio you can't use your body language, no one's going to see it. So it, it requires a lot of musical knowledge and a lot of group cohesiveness. Being part of a project where I know I'm going to be recording, where I know that this music is going to end up on a CD, I really have to kind of dig deeper in terms of how prepared I am on that music because whatever I end up playing on that recording is really set in stone. There's a lot of little complex details that you work on when you're in the recording session, uh, such as levels and gain and boosts and how you interact with the other musicians and how that all comes across on the tape. So I've really learned how to manage all that. It's been a an exciting journey, um, not quite knowing where it goes, but then when you look back and see the amount of ground that you've covered, um, very few places we could do something like this, so it, it's a special place.